Hello everyone. My name is James Reeves and you are watching Got a lot of stuff to talk to you guys about today, but before we get to that, of course, first things first. Somebody sent in Rogue Culture Clash Imperial Blonde Ale blended with kombucha tea. 6.9%, not bad. Nice little hefty weight of one pint and 9.4 ounces. Beer and a half in there. I'm not excited about this. Uh, this sounds like hippie bullshit, um, hippie propaganda. Mm, smells kind of weird. Did someone literally send me poison? What is kombucha tea? Is that like that weird stuff that they get from like fox-eared bat poop or whatever, <laughs> whatever that, the beans, the, the coffee beans from Servals. Is that what it is? I can't remember. I don't drink coffee or tea, so I really don't give a shit, but I do drink beer. God, I have never been so terrified to drink a beer on mailroom. I have no idea what I'm getting myself into. Is this one huge prank? Is this an inside joke that you guys are playing on me? Is this actually got this picture of sloth? Is it sloth feces? I, I don't know what kombucha is. That is just, I mean, it's just bad. I mean, it just tastes like somebody took beer and mixed it with lemonade and stale Skittles. Oof, I'd have to go get a Millie. I'm sorry, this might be the one time this shit might be going straight down the turlet. Yeet. Woo, wash that kombucha out. Ah, so much better. Anyways, clearly I'm behind and I apologize for that because technically this is the July 2019 mailroom, but I'm filming it like late middle August. And I apologize, been really busy, just got back from Thunder Ranch. Um, and then the weekend prior to that, I was at TriggerCon. So I've been out of town a lot and then catching up trying to make videos. There are a bunch of new guns that have come out like the Divorce 7 that I haven't even gone and shot yet. I've shot it a bunch in the past, but haven't done my review yet. A new 10 millimeter submachine gun here that is coming out on September 10 that is going to hit TFB TV. So I've been busy and I apologize. I love you guys. I owe you an apology. That's no excuse. Uh, just piss poor performance from James J. Reeves. We have a lot of important stuff to talk about, but I can't talk about all of it on today's episode. Are we doing the gun giveaways? Yes, and we're continuing to do the gun giveaways. However, I have taken down tfbtv.gun.team that has the list of all the winners. I've taken that down temporarily. A lot of people have asked me, hey, where'd it go? You still doing gun giveaways? Yes, we're still doing gun giveaways. I'm about to announce four winners. So two for July, two for August. I said if we got over a thousand patrons that we'd kick it up to two guns. And guys, I'm thinking about if we hit 1500, which we're almost there, um, I might kick it up to three guns. Uh, we'll see. But um, there are some developments. There are some San Franciscan social media companies. Uh, tr truly, I can't talk about it right now who are trying to stop us from having a good time. Even though we're apolitical, um, we just like to have fun. I mean, nothing crazy on here. I'm generally safe. I really shouldn't be trusted with a gun, but other than that, generally a safe channel. So the whole thing kind of pisses me off. But I guess what I can say is very soon, TFB TV is going to be self-sufficient. Now we've already moved over to BitChute. BitChute, bunch of great guys. They're really now we're still going to be showing videos on YouTube. Um, and it isn't just YouTube I'm talking about. Like we've got some issues with um, other service providers. And I'm going to make all of that clear to you once we kind of get the plan completed to a certain point. But we're already kind of migrating our videos, our archive videos, the older ones, over to BitChute. There's got to be probably near 100 of them on there already of like the 1,200 or so TFB TV videos that there are. So we're slowly migrating those over to BitChute. BitChute's super happy to have us. They blasted out some big tweet. I didn't even want anyone to know that we were moving to BitChute and they blast out this huge tweet that's like, oh yeah, TFB TV is on BitChute. So, you know, they're excited, whatever, that's great. And I'm happy 
that they're happy. Anyways, bitshoot.com slash TFBTV if you'd rather watch us on BitChute. But in the meantime, YouTube is still our hosting platform. We still get paid by YouTube. We're one of the lucky few channels that hasn't been completely demonetized yet. So, you know, if you watch us on BitChute, we don't get paid dick. At least if you watch us on YouTube, uh, we get paid. But I'm going to explain everything hopefully by the next mailroom, if not the one after that, because we are, TFB TV is going to be self-sufficient and we're not going to have to rely on. Anyways, where was I? Oh yeah, so giveaways. Here's how we're gonna do giveaways from now on. What I'm gonna do is I'm, uh, I'm still gonna use random.org. It randomly selects viewers from a CSV, like a spreadsheet of uh, all the Patreon supporters at the five or the $10 level plus the manual entrance. Of course, you can email me every month and manually enter. I have to do that by law. If you're gonna be a freeloading bastard, you can do that. But what I'm gonna do is if you are a gold level patron, you get the first pick of the guns because we've got a bunch of different guns and I can't wait to announce what we have this month. But gold level patrons get first pick and then it goes by seniority. So if you're a gold level patron for a year, you get to pick before if all the other winners are gold level winners, um, if you're the one, the most senior, you get to pick. Um, so you've got your golds by seniority, then you've got your OD green tier by seniority. So my Goldie boys are gonna get first pick, and we actually had no golds, unfortunately, picked uh, this time. First, let me announce our belt winners, up to $100 belts. And of course, I'm gonna announce four of you uh, from Blue Alpha Gear. So these four names I'm about to announce, you guys get $100 each to spend at Blue Alpha Gear. Caleb, that's all you have is your name is Caleb, but your email address is neoswing0 at blank. Um, Ratatosk the Silent, more like Ratatosk the Virgin, but if you wanna shoot me an email, james at tfbtv, you've got one too. Also, Brandon O'Connor, and then it's a Daylib for the Calebs, because that is two Calebs. Caleb Meyer, you also win. So we've got two Calebs, Brandon O'Connor, and a guy who plays role-playing games in his mom's basement. Congratulations. Four guns. Here's what we have to give away. And here's, I took some pictures, I'm doing some hand modeling for you. A Smith & Wesson Model 69, 44 Magnum revolver and stainless. Ooh, that's pretty good. A SIG P226R Mark 25 Navy. Again, an $1,100 gun that's brand spanking new. You guys remember, I gave this away maybe two months ago. The guy was in California, couldn't accept it. So I just gave him like 600 bucks cash instead. The Rex Delta in 9mm, an excellent gun, and the IWI Masada, and I'm including two frames with your IWI Masada, so you can cut one down or stipple it or put Punisher skulls all over it, whatever it is you want to do. Ah, so four awesome guns, here are the winners. Number four, you are the least senior, you're getting the last pick. Jonathan Carroll, C-A-R-R-O-L-L. -L. You've been an OD Green member for only two months, so you are number four, but congratulations. Pretty good return on investment for you, huh? Lamar Breeshears, B-R-E-S-H-E-A-R-S. -E -E Lamar, you've been an OD Green member for three months, so you are number three. Chris L L Labuszewski, super Polish. Uh, congratulations, Chris. Congratulations, Ski. You have been an OD Green member for four months, so you're number two. And then finally, our big number one is Max Donald. Max is OD Green Squad, but he's been a patron since July of 2017. So Max, you send me an email with one gun, whichever gun you want, you get it. Just pick one. Uh, Jonathan, you're gonna get whatever's left over, so you don't have to send me an email. Chris and Lamar, if you guys could send me like a ranked list of those guns that I just read in order, I'll send you your highest unpicked preference. So congratulations, guys. Sorry we had to do four giveaways this month just because I'm falling so far behind, but congrats to all the winners. And the giveaways are going to continue no matter what. All right, finally, all of that out of the way. As you guys can see, quite a bit, of, you can't even see the top. Let's get started with a letter, Dr. Doorhammer. I don't think that's your real name. Dr. Doorhammer says, oh, I love it when there's grease stains. 
I was gonna send my bump stock, but I lost it in a freak gasoline fight incident. Nice Zoolander reference. P.S. It wasn't on a boat, so it's not at the bottom of the ocean. It just melted. P.P.S. Definitely not ATF. Love this dust cover air for an Air 15. It says, sounds like fud shit, but okay. Beautiful, I'll go ahead and add this to the build. For those of you just tuning in for the first time ever, we've got a little build going. I'm gonna put a video of it up at the end because I think some of these gun parts are in these boxes and we're gonna see the progress. We're really not that far behind. There's, we've made some progress on the Pen 15 build, um, but we're gonna go ahead and throw this dust cover in there and uh, use that as part of the build. Next, all right, this looks like it's from Europe, in which case it's probably a t-shirt or something, or it's from Asia, in which case it's a waifu pillow. Feels like a waifu pillow. Smells like a waifu pillow. Ah, it's from Europe, it's t-shirts. I knew it. <laughs> I love it. Oh God, I'm so wet. Beautiful. Got some patches, we'll go ahead and add those up there to the patch wall. I hope you guys saw that, it was pretty cool. It just kinda <laughs> stuck on there. From my cold dead feet. There we go, patches, 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 patches. So that's cool. And we got some awesome stickers as well from Bestia. Let's see what it says. I'm probably butchering the pronunciation. Dear Mr. Reeves, I'll start off with some no homo dick riding and get out of the way. I like the cut of your jib. I've been a big fan of you and your work for quite some time now. Thank you very much. I think I've probably seen pretty much everything you've made at least in this century. All right, now we're getting creepy. And I've only, I've always only heard positive things about you as a person from people who have met you. Uh, that's cool. Uh, that's why I consider you one of my biggest role models and inspirations. This is, this is some hard D riding, but that's okay. You keep going, man. I'm not going to stop you. I especially loved your Terran Tactical John Wick stuff. Really cool. Now that that's out of the way, let's get on with the fun stuff. Just some quick background. Bestia.eu, and I'm going to drop that in the description so you guys can go check it out because this stuff is actually pretty awesome that he just sent in. Is a one-man gang operating out of Europe, one-man wolf pack. Yes, we can own guns. I started it as a means to focus my free time towards promoting things I enjoy, mainly guns and general memory. Shout out to my egg bros from K. Oh God, Commando, I knew it. I mostly make patches and shirts that are gun and military themed, so I figured you might like them. No big titty weeb shit though. Good, thank you, I like that. And I actually do really like your stuff. Uh, this is, I get a lot of crap on Mailroom. This is not crap. Uh, you're very talented and I'm impressed with your side hustle. Good branding as well. Alongside this loving letter, there's two shirts, one in medium and one in big boy L. I thought you could maybe give one away to your fans or something. I also threw in a bunch of patches and stickers, which are yours to keep or give away. Whatever you feel like doing, man, you're your own person. That's pretty much it as far as I'm concerned. The only other message is to all the neats watching to support gun channels, F the EU and keep your lobby as moldy. Also, you're amazing in John Wick 3. Can't wait for the next one. Hugs and kisses, your pal Rocco or Roco or some shit like that. P.S. I also kind of like your slightly fatter, uglier, and let's be honest, probably smaller PP brother, James. He's into gun stuff too, right? Ha, 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 ha. He wrote that like it was to Keanu. Very clever, motherfucker. I already know what this is. This is towards the Pen 15 build. And this is our barrel. This is the heart and soul of the Pen 15. I feel like Aragorn, like what was the name of his, weird name of his sword? That's what this feels like. Um, this is a massive, this looks like a heavy profile stainless steel barrel. Oh my God. AR-15 25 by 45 sharps, 24 inch, one in 10 bull rifle. I don't know anything about 25 to 45 sharps. This is terrible. Why would anybody do this to me? Speaking of a uh, low receiver, I kind of gave away another thing that we received and that is this uh, custom engraved TFB TV lower receiver for the Pen 15 build. Got a little possum here on this side. This was done lovingly by Speedy Taco, a member of our Discord chat. And yeah, this is really good engraving. 
I will cherish this. What I love is the hand guard. Here's the hand guard that we have. This is gonna be pretty funny because the gas tube's gonna be exposed for quite a bit of distance uh, with this hand guard. Um, why are you guys doing this to me? Do you, do you hate me? I've never shot a gun, a 25 sharps. I've never even seen one in person. Something from Amazon. Liar Town, the first four years. You guys obviously know that I like possums. James, this book contains some NSF TFB TV images, so you may want to pre-select a page to show the people. I sent this because it's the funniest book in the world and I want the author to become a bajillionaire. John, sweet ass Glock 26B. I remember you, John, sweet ass Glock 26B. You're the guy who won a holster drawing, I think, for Patreon. I'm definitely going to end up as a skin suit. Like one of you guys is gonna abduct me and skin me and turn me into a, a skin suit. This is just weird. All right, next one. Benjamin Hernandez. Dear James, I've been one of your biggest buttholes for some time now. God, that is a competition, as you can see. There are some substantial buttholes that watch this channel. Um, really wanted to send you a flashlight, but I only have one. Saw these sights and they reminded me of your dick. Thought they would work well on your AR build. Sincerely, Benjamin. Thank you, Benjamin. Oh my God, this is perfect. This is perfect. Unlike the barrel, Mabs, these sights are going to be absolutely perfect for the Pen15 build. Thank you, Benjamin. To Jamothy JJ Reeves. Dear James, made you look. Love, Benjamin. I'm not going to stop mail rooming just because you pay me now. So that's two Benjamins, because I know which Benjamin this Benjamin is. This is not a California Benjamin. This is like a Massachusetts Benjamin who now writes for the blog. Amazing. So I've got a backup set. Maybe, do I have to put all of them on there? I guess so. We're gonna run out of real estate in this handguard with all these um, hands and fingers and testicles and penises and such. All right, Stubbs, I know that you've sent me something. That's another guy from the chat room. I know you're really excited about it and I saw it in here. It's probably gonna be at the bottom of the damn box. <sighs> I mean, this guy, Stubbs, was so excited to send this to me that he's been pestering me about picking it up, pestering me about opening it. He even told me what it was. So, you know, not gonna tr even try to feign surprise. I'm sure it's going to be sufficiently horrifying that you're, it's going to evoke a genuine reaction, but that reaction will be disgust, not shock. Here we go again. It's your dude Stubbs with free memes and muffled screams and it's penis time. Now available from the cum dungeon. Horsecock 15 with horse cocks and balls. Prices too low to show. Balls too low to show. I am a professional as my, I am an attorney as my day job and this is what I do with my free time. My God, and there's so much hair, Stubbs. I know you're deliberately putting what looks like pubic hair in this box. Oh my God, this is so gross. Oof. All right, and then there we go. Stubbs, you happy? Look, big horse cock and balls, TFB TV. I mean, at a certain point, you just have to put down the 3D printer, Stubbs because this is a masterwork. I mean, really, you just need to throw that 3D printer into the drainage pond in front of your trailer because you're not going to be able to outdo yourself. This is from Danny Start. I also know Danny from the chat room. So, by the way, I think they're keeping a, a spreadsheet on there of all the components that I've received for the build. So if you wanna go on there, the Discord chat, the link is at the bottom in the description. Um, I mean, obviously they're all deranged, so uh, be careful, but there is somebody keeping track of this stuff. Great, excellent, 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 excellent. I know what this is. Possum pictures. 
to James from Danny, TFB TV Discord, Great Britain expat. Got some Taco Bell fire sauce in there, which is my absolute favorite. Box of gum, not gonna eat that. Not gonna eat any consumables you guys send me. Send me all the consumables you want to. If you guys made it, I'm not gonna eat it. And looky here. Oh my God. So, <laughs> wrapped in a Trojan Magnum condom for my monster dong. Um, we have a beautiful AR-15 upper. Was this a custom job? I mean, this tape work is outstanding. I'm going to have to remove all the fire sauce before I shoot it, but thank you. And what looks like used earplugs. Thank you so much. At what point do I call the police? All right, guys, this is going to be the last one, and then I'm going to show you the progress of the TFB TV Pen 15 build. I'm hopping on a plane to Medellin, Colombia. I've got to finish packing, and like seriously, my flight leaves in like two and a half hours. And I'm going to cut this video on the plane and hopefully upload it tonight when I have a stopover in Miami. Heston 3D Solutions. That sounds good. Like this might be 3D printed Pen 15 components. Hi James, I asked Pete, that's my boss, if I should send you a set of these, he said sure, why not? Don't know if you saw the post on Reddit with them, they're adapters that turn 33, a pair of 33 round Glock magazines into nunchucks. Oh my God, that's perfect. That is perfect. Um, here's the post, you can find the pics and gifs on my Reddit profile at user slash Heston Kent. H-E-S-T-O-N-K-E-N-T. -E feel free to do literally whatever you want with the chucks. If you feel like plugging them, you can drop a link in your article or video or whatever. Um, his website is h3dsolutions.com. h3dsolutions.com if you want Glock Magazine nunchucks. It's pretty awesome. This is some of the goofiest shit I've ever done, and I've done quite a bit of shit posting on Reddit. Hope you have fun with them. I promise you I will. True story, guys. Um, <laughs> I'm ashamed to admit this, but I did Kung Fu when I was in high school and we did a little bit of nunchuck work. So I'm a little rusty around the edges, but once I get my Glock 33 round magazines hooked up, yep, I see how this works. This is genius. Thank you very much. This is brilliant. All right, seriously, last one, last one. We got a ton of letters and I've been ignoring them. So let me pull one of this from a certain redhead who can weld. Ah, okay, God, we've had quite the turnout from Discord. I know, I recognize this name. Thick thighs save lives, but thigh highs are my demise. I like it. Oh no, glitter. Son of a bitch. I just got a new rug in here. Just got a new rug. Dear James, it's your girl welding ginger. Decided to get extra with this letter. I hope you enjoy the glitter bomb enclosed. We're gonna try to handle that a la Keanu Reeves and speed. Uh, the color of the glitter is gunmetal. I figured you'd appreciate it. I do. Stay fancy with your bad self and keep, hold on, hold on. And keep making amazing videos. I will try. Sincerely, one of the only girls in the TFB Discord. You just added yourself. You're fucked. You're going to get dick pics in your DMs from everybody, including myself. P.S. Enjoy the patches and stickers as well. Thank you, Welding Ginger. It's always nice to have someone from the fairer sex in the TFB TV chat room. True story. 96% of our viewers are male by demographic. So glad to see that we've got some females watching even if they do try to send me glitter bombs. So now I'm about to get on this plane and I do have glitter all over my pants. Thank you for that. Guys, that about wraps it up. I mean, I think that's, I'm gonna show you real quick. Here's the progress of the build. I mean, it looks like I pretty much have everything that I need. I might need like a buffer and uh, like a lower, I mean, obviously a lower parts kit, um, upper parts kit. I mean, just really like little components. Um, this is gonna be pretty terrible. I don't think I can use that cookie cutter break now. Again, I don't know anything about 25 sharps, but can I use a 223 slash 556 break on a 25 sharps barrel? 
I mean, what even is 25 sharps? Guys, thanks a ton. You guys are the best viewers in the entire world. Thank you so much for your support on Patreon. Really, we couldn't do this without you guys. Guys, I love you. Don't send me any more of that shambucha bullshit beer, whatever it was. Take care of yourselves. Hopefully, I'll make it back from Columbia live. By the time you see this video, I mean, I'm going to have this thing set to go live like Friday or Saturday. I will be in Medellin, so feel free to shoot me an email if you're in the area and you're not a kidnapper terrorist.